In this video, I will review the best 5 star spoil arms for Sino. You are also gonna find how big the difference between 3 and 4 star spoil arms with these 5 star spoil arms. Let's start from rank number 4, the Staff of Homa. This is great for obvious reasons. High critical damage substats. It is on par with critical damage circulate, so you can equip critical rate circulate to achieve 1 to 2 ratio easily. However, the base attack is kinda low and Sino doesn't have health scaling abilities. Health boost is useful because he stays in the field for a long time. Assuming he has 22,000 health, then you get about 400 attack when his health below 50%. But that's kinda dangerous and he has no way to reduce his health unlike Hu Tao. For rank number 3, we have Calamity Queller. This spear has the highest base attack of all pole arms. Combined with its substats, your Sino will have very high attack. The only problem is, it is quite hard to achieve 1 to 2 ratio. Elemental damage boost is great since Sino only deals electro damage in burst form. You can only get 19.2% attack boost from consummation since he is active on the field. Regardless of that, it still performs better and isn't as dangerous as the staff of Homa. For rank number 2, we have Primordial Jade Wing Spear. This is my favorite DPS pole arm because you can easily trigger the effect and have very good base attack and substats. You will see later that it is really close to the staff of Scarlet Sense. And if you are curious about White Tassel, then as you can see right now, Primordial Jade Wing Spear is about 5 to 10% better. You may think it is small difference, but remember it is only for normal attack. For elemental skill and other things, White Tassel is like 30 to 40 percent worse than these five stars pole arms. And finally, the best pole arm for Sino is Staff of the Scarlet Sands. Like I said, it is pretty close to Primordial Jade Wing Spear. However, having higher elemental mastery make your reaction damage will be much higher than using Primordial Jade Wing Spear. Sino Talon also increase the normal attack damage by the amount of elemental mastery that he has. To maximize this spear, I recommend you to use Gilded Dreams artifact sets. So in the end, this is Sino 5 stars pole arm tier list. Pole arms in S and A tier are better than 4 stars pole arms and our beloved White Tassel. So you don't need to be confused which one to equip if you have the 5 star spoil arms. I can say that they are like 20 to 30% better. As for pole arm in B tier, you can use them but there is something that contradicts with Sino. For example, Vortex Vanquisher is good but you need to have shield to get the boost. And because Sino stays on the field for a long time, it's kind of hard to maintain his shield. And finally, on Genshin Impact, artifacts have biggest role in the game. Having higher stars weapon simply mean you can slack off a little bit in your artifact setup. That's why I'm gonna talk about Sino artifact set in the next video. Make sure you subscribe, like the video if you find it useful. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.